Line two, Trois Rivières, uh, Beausivert, Couchons, Gilbert, and Lemire. Again, I pardon my French is absolutely horrible. Lane three, Banuk, Armstrong, Monroe, Parsons, and Travis. In lane four, Calgary's uh, Gurgulis, Hampshire, Kendall, and Windsor. In lane five, Banuk's Brownling, Messenger, Pennyfather, and Vernoy. In lane six, Card, English, uh, Nugulik, and Tool. In lane seven, Ritos, Karanko, Cross, Hoffrick, and McIntosh. Lane eight, uh, Cartman, <laughs> D Desiro, uh, Morin, and Rochette. And in lane nines, Allen, Boulge, Lavelle Latour, and Uglin. I apologize to anybody that watches this back and I completely butchered your names. It is not intentionally. <laughs> So these ladies have a great start. We have a clean start. Uh, K4, very fast race. Uh, and Sam, you said K4 is actually your specialty. Yeah, this was the race that I had the most success in, in my paddling career. And, and it's a ton of fun because when it's going well, it feels incredible. So you'll see the, the big thing to keep that rate high is keeping those legs together and holding that leg down. So it's a little bit harder to see, but you'll see all their legs are pumping and they're turning their shoulders at the same time, trying to hit that water almost at the same time. But you'll notice that each spot back, they're slightly further ahead than the person in front of them. And as they head into this last 200 meters of that race, it looks like that that white boat out in lane six, uh, that's Masquaz, Card, English, Nagulik, and Push Tool. Uh, we've heard a lot about these athletes already in the K200, but don't count out lane five uh, from Burloke uh, coming in strong as well in that stripe boat. It looks like we're going to have a real race for the gold medal. So here's when you're really going to see all that hard work pay off. They're all feeling the pain. You can see that the strokes are getting a little bit shorter and a little bit choppier. They're just fighting to hold on to those paddles and push right through the line. You can see Burlo just pulled away at the end. That's all conditioning at the beginning of the season that's playing out now. Yeah, Burlo just pulling away at the end. They're giving themselves the national title. Masqua uh, completely exhausted there at the end. Just didn't have enough in them to catch that nice little striped Burlo boat. And uh, we're going to see a replay in just a moment here so we can really analyze what happened. But uh, in a 500-meter race in K4, it's an extremely fast race, so you're really giving it your all the entire way. Yeah, look at Calgary and Rito just came right up as they passed Trois-Rivières in that finish. I don't even want to call the finish now. I don't think you we'll can. We'll wait for the final, the final results we'll in this wait. one for sure. Exactly. A little too close to call uh, on our part to the naked eye or the eye with glasses on in my case. And uh, overall, a great competition. U19 women's K4, 500 meter final. Some more hardware being handed out here at the Canadian National Sprint Canoe Kayak Championships. So there is actually, not that, not that we are trying to call the race